Well, today we get a little help from the master to tell the story of how this place came to be, then not be, then reappear on the map. Edgar B. Landon moved to this area from Michigan in 1908, and he is credited with bringing the name of this area with him. There was a post office that was established in 1912. Unfortunately, it burned to the ground. Here's how Bob Long himself tells the story. And then in 61, 1961, the disastrous Harlow fire. It touched coarse gold at Oakhurst. It burned a part of Awani, killed two people, and it virtually wiped out. Ed Landon's saloon, the post office, the store, all destroyed, nothing left. But as we said, these were hardworking people, mountain people, and they have a way of surviving. Just in the last few years, we've noticed a brand new set of old buildings being put up to replace those that were burned. That film was shot by Earl Bradley, Bob Long's longtime partner, in the 1980s when this building was new. It was called the Old Nip. It was a saloon. Well, now it's a private residence. The town, that name was taken from an Algonquin language that means plenty of deer. And that word is Nipponawasi on the map of Madeira County. With Earl Bradley behind the camera, I'm Bob Long. With Josh Dean behind the camera, I'm AJ Fox. That was a fun story to do, and you can watch this and other installments of our On the Map series by going to our website, yourcentralvalley.com forward slash on the map. So good to see Bob Long. I know. Oh. He, he really had a passion for telling those stories, and it's great that AJ has That's kind of right. inherited that passion. Absolutely. We love it.